most venues in the NFL. There's a look at Arrowhead Stadium here in Kansas City. The scene a few moments ago, here it is. It's unlike any other in sport as both teams made their way out of the tunnel. These folks are fired up as their guys are ready to do battle. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22 with the Los Angeles Chargers. L.A. set to take over again on offense. and 10 Herbert quick hitter here it's complete and he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down second and right at a yard it's a gain of nine one thing we do know he's going to get his catches so as they move forward defensively got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the secondary that last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable second and one and he'll get it up near the 35, right at the 34 here. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. Second and one, and people want to run the football. This is where every back in the league is supposed to do exactly what we just saw there, pick up the first down. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. They'll run here with Eckler. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Chris Jones, Chris Jones on the stop. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a force of nature at the defensive tackle position. Yes, he's as big as they come, but still plenty agile. He's able to make a nice play there to swallow up the ball carrier. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Herbert will give this one to Eckler. Well, that second down run, a big help. The seven yards leaves him with just a third and three now. Well, that's why the guy with the headsets is down there. All right, they know what they're doing because they got stuffed on a running play on first down. And I think myself and probably the fans were saying, throw the football in this situation. But he knew what he was doing, called another run, and now they've got third and short. They'll try to pick up the first with Eckler. That is not going to be any help as they dump him behind the line of scrimmage. They'll wind up losing three yards here. And it'll be fourth down. Brings up fourth down. Fourth down and on is Ty Long to punt. Here's Hardman to return. A very nice punt that time, but they get 11 back on the return. And it's Chiefs football, first and 10. And now here comes Kansas City. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs on first and 10, right at the 30. And they'll begin by running the option. Chargers able to get the pressure and bring him down. The former number three pick, Joey Bosa, bringing the lumber that time. That's called setting the tone right away. It certainly is, and it lets you know just how important communication is amongst the offensive line. They talk about it all the time, knowing each other's moves. You've got to be coordinated and in sync. Otherwise, your quarterback gets hit. To try again after the sack. Mahomes, and this one caught by Travis Kelsey. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. It's a pickup of 17 and a first down. And that was good protection there. No, that was great protection there because it allowed him to lock in on his receiver. Although I think he was looking for his tight end on the corner route all the way. Nice connection there for a really nice gain. They'll run for the first time with Clyde Edwards-Alaire. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. Another strong gain on the last two plays. They've moved it a combined 33 yards. That's a very nice game there. Confidence-building run. Love the execution up front. And the way he pressed the hole, absolutely perfect. So from Charger territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 38. Working from the gun, Mahomes. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. 
And inside the 20 before he's brought down. Another good gain. That's now 35 yards combined on those last two plays. Good job there to locate his tight end, Charles, in the middle of the field. Yeah, he has good pass-catching abilities, and if they're able to continue to find him here in the early going, I think it'll help out his teammates out on the perimeter. You can take the big shots later if he occupies their attention. Mahomes on target there to Hill. And they'll work this down to the 15 for a pickup of four. They'll contain him to just four. Second down. It's now second and six. We're scoreless after one. Second quarter from Arrowhead. It's the Chiefs in possession as they are looking at a second down and six coming up. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. That's going to be caught at the 10-yard line. Mahomes. And he'll get it here to the 10-yard line. Robinson. That catch good for five. It's third down. Brings up third and one. Now it's Mahomes again. This will be caught at about the six. And the Chiefs are going to have a first and goal coming up as they find a way to convert there on third and one. The gain of five that time gives them the conversion and makes it first and goal. At the five-yard line. Now Bell. And he's going to get him about three yards closer. He's down to about the two. Ben, in all things considered, they have to feel pretty good about getting that type of a gain considering the blitz that they just had against him. From the two now, second and goal. They'll try and run it in with Bell. And this time he is in. Yes. Taking it in for two yards out as his guys are first out of the scoreboard here this afternoon. Well, Brandon, he just followed his nose, and his nose took him to the end zone. But how about the big guys up front giving him at least a stalemate in order to find that space? Yeah, the O-line won the battle in the trenches there, didn't it? And his kick is good to make it 7-0 KC. Makes the score. Chiefs seven, Chargers nothing. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. Fielded a couple yards into the end zone. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. The Chargers get set to go here for their second drive. They'll be looking to match that touchdown from a moment ago. 7-0 is the score as they begin with a first down. They started on the ground with Eckler. Even with that broken tackle, can't go very far. Stop short of the 30. And give him four yards there. It'll be second and six. They'd love to just strike back with a touchdown right here. And if it's a long play, so be it. But the main goal, get a couple of first downs. Run some plays, run some clock. Allow their defense to get a chance to catch their breath. Settle down and relax a little bit after they just gave up a score. Now this one to his running back out of the backfield. And he gets this one just shy of the 40, down at the 39. 11 yards there, first down. Well, that certainly has to feel good. It's not all the time that the play caller should get all the credit. 
Sometimes I think in the huddle, the quarterback just says, hey, who's going to make a play for me? I just need something right here. And the end result there, nice first down. Drive keeps moving. On first down, it's Herbert. And a quick throw here, that's complete. And he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. Give him nine there on the first down completion. Brandon, perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and they passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was complete. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory at the 48-yard line. Out of the gun, Herbert. Throw right side, complete to Williams. That catch good for only a couple. Mike Williams. Two yards on the pickup. It's second and eight at the 46-yard line. Now Herbert got to get him to the line in a hurry. On second down, here's Herbert. And it's knocked away and incomplete. incomplete. One thing that offensive guys stress when they throw the deep ball, you're just counting on your receiver to find it, adjust before the defensive back can get his head around. In this case, though, the DB matched it move for move and knocked it away. They'll need to get this to the 38. That's where the first down marker is here on third. From the shotgun, here's Herbert. And that's into the hands of Eckler. And the tackle going to be made at the 41 as they stop him a few yards short of the first. Five yards, not enough. And it'll be fourth down. How about that strategy there, Brandon? Third down, they just said, we've got faith in our tacklers. We'll give you the short stuff and just decided to protect the sticks. So every time I hear fans telling me tackling's not a part of the game anymore, plays like that, I can clip and save and show them you have to tackle well if you want to be a good defense. The Chiefs take over. Kansas City taking the field for their second drive. And you're under a minute to go here in the half. Field position not really in your favor, but still time to try and move the ball and get in field goal range. Yeah, you've got the lead. It's a, definitely a thought. Let's go ahead and try and increase it. But at the same time, I don't like the odds. I don't like where they are in the field. Got the lead. They've done well in the first half. Don't mess it up and go into halftime looking at each other wondering what if. That one complete to Hill. And able to get this across the 20 before going out of bounds. Give him nine there on the first down completion. People worry about throwing the out route because often it can get jumped and that can turn to an either an incompletion or an interception. But not on that one. Everything came together and he catches it and goes over the sideline. Throwing again on second down. Mahomes complete the tight end, Kelsey. The Chiefs now going to use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 35 seconds to go in quarter number two. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. From the gun, it's Mahomes. And he'll get this underneath to Bell. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little game. Good down to possibly take a shot, and in fact, they'll come up with an empty backfield on second and inches. And again, it's Mahomes looking right side, and that's complete to Watkins. And he'll get it out to midfield. Let's see, yeah, they'll spot it right at midfield at the 50. The Chiefs quickly now going to use the last of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 21 seconds to go here in the first half. Yellow. 
from midfield. Here's Mahomes. Open man is Hill. He's got it. And he'll go down inside the 45 before going out of bounds. A gain of six there on first. It's a pickup of six. Brings up second and four. Line of scrimmage, the 43 on second and four. Here's Edwards Hilaire. And tackled down after a gain of three. Leaves him with one yard to go on third down. Clyde Edwards Hilaire, the ball carrier. The tackle by Kenneth Murray. That's a gain of three. It's third and one. So we've reached halftime with just the lone touchdown here. 7-0 is our score. As we send you down to Orlando, where Jonathan Coachman has our EA Sports halftime report. Coach. Okay, Coach. Appreciate it. A one-touchdown game here as we get set to resume play in the second half. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. Here comes the Chiefs offensive unit as they'll have it to begin quarter number three. Their defense has pitched the shutout. Now they probably need to deliver a little breathing room, maybe make it a two-score game as they've got it first and ten. Here's Mahomes to throw. Gets this one to Hill. That catch good for only a couple. Never make the mistake that the slot receivers, especially the little guys that we're watching here, are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine quickness and speed, and they catch a lot of footballs, as we just saw there. So second and eight here after the pass play for two yards on first down. To throw, it's Mahomes. Wide open is Watkins. He's got him. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. Just his second catch of the game so far. This one moves the chains. And how about this throw right here? Had to throw it to the left sideline. And you know the timing's got to be correct on this one. Ball's got to be right where it needs to be. And it was. That's because he had great arm strength on that one. Able to drive the football. Quarterbacks love it when they can show off their arms. The head coach relied on his eagle eye in the sky to make the right call and was told to challenge it, and it looks like it's paid off. And from a coach's standpoint, when you throw that flag, it's probably a pretty tense moment here at Paisal. Yeah, you have that little bit of indecision. You throw it where you feel like you're right, and then you think, uh-oh, did I get it right? In this case, they can celebrate. Good. Give him 15 yards on that one. Kansas City has a first down. But we can talk about it like it's just a basic route, but how about the timing on this one? Lined up on the right, runs a deep in route, and how about the throw? Right on the money. Bam! Puts it right in there and on his hands. Nice completion. Really good pickup. Mahomes now on first down. Quick hitter here. It's complete. And he'll be taken down at the 46-yard line. They'll contain him to just four, second down. It's vitally important to wrap him up immediately because if you let that big guy get ahead of steam up, boy, then you've got real trouble trying to get him down. But they're able to hold him to a short gain on first down. Inside four minutes to go, third quarter. On second down, it's Bell. And he works his way forward for about four up to the midfield stripe. In the first half, he was held in check on the ground, but despite that lack of production, they still have the lead. Yeah, they've got to feel fortunate about that. If they could actually get production from their lead horse, that would help open up this offense and widen this margin, too. They'll go again with Bell. And he's got this down to the 35. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Chiefs first down. Well, you certainly have to give a little credit here because they're playing this game now at their pace. This is ball control football, sustained runs, taking their time and making it work. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. Throwing now is Mahomes. Now he's forced out right. And he's going to keep it here. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. 
I guess no need to force it when you can do that instead. First down, 18-yard gain. Well, that was man coverage. So once he decides to run with the football, there's no one to account for him, and he turns it into a nice gain. So from the 17 now, here's a first and 10. And he stopped immediately there. The tight end, the ball carrier. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. No gain on the play. Brings up second and 10 at the 17-yard line. Third quarter of a tight football game as we come up on a second and 10. They'll run. It's Edwards Alaire. And effective running here. He'll take it down inside the 10. Nine yards, not quite enough, and they'll be left now with third and one. Looks to me like maybe there's a little attrition setting in with this drive, because when you see that type of a run, I get the feeling the defense gets a little bit tired. And that's the last thing they need, especially when they look up at the scoreboard. Mahomes to throw on third and one. Looking for Kelsey there, but it's intercepted. Picked by Kenneth Murray. He's at the 50. And he'll take this across midfield and inside the 45. He'll take over first and 10 at the 44-yard line. Running on first down, Eckler. And this has been a familiar sight all afternoon as they stop him behind the line. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. This defense is just flat getting after it. They have not given up much of anything in the run game. Case in point right there. They're not going to get to the line to run another play. So we will switch ends as the third quarter has come to a close. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. Justin Herbert looking to throw on second down. And he'll find his man on the out route. That's Allen. That one good for 10 yards. And that'll bring up what looks to be a third and inches. Can't be more than a half a foot. And inches. Here is Heckler. Shedding the tackler, and it gives him some room. Touchdown, L.A. Austin Eckler, 35 yards. And the Chargers are an extra point away from tying this thing up. So they went to the ground game on third, hoping to pick up the first. They also picked up a touchdown. Offensive linemen so used in this situation to having to pass block. All right, you're looking at what it is, third down. They don't care that it's third and whatever. They figure they're going to throw the ball. And when you call a running play, I think you, I think you energize them. I think you juice them up because I haven't met offensive linemen yet that likes to pass block more than they like to run block. And they opened up some nice holes there for him, and he took it to the house. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. And makes it across the 20 as his guys will set up shop at the 23-yard line. KC's offense ready to take over. Well, they just gave up the score to tie it. That's the bad news. The good news, plenty of time in this fourth quarter to try to grab that lead back. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs up first and 10 at their own 23. He'll set up the throw from the gun. This is complete to Watkins on the slant. 
And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. A good pickup there. Eight yards on the first down completion. Nothing fancy on first down, but a very consistent type of a play. Hit that slant. A lot of people call it an extension of the running game, and it can be if that pass is completed because you hit a guy on the run like that, he often can go for big yardage. Sets him up nicely for second down, staying ahead of schedule. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. He got maybe a half yard at most, but officially they'll be left with a third and two. And two. The Chiefs on third down. They've been good, three for four thus far. Here it's third and two. Again, it's Bell. And he's going to be taken down here, still a couple yards short of the first. Just a yard on the run there, and that's going to bring us to a fourth down. I know the scouting report on him is that he doesn't possess the eye discipline to be an elite linebacker, and what that means is his ability to read, react, and make a play. But on that one, he looked like one of those guys. Here's the Chiefs punter now, as he's on to punt for the first time this afternoon. So a change of possession here on the punt. And it'll be Charger football here as they take over. L.A. readies for its next possession. Excellent job by their defense to force the punt and provide them with this opportunity all tied in the fourth quarter. Here's Eckler to begin the drive. A gain of three, second down. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. A shotgun snap for Herbert. Short pass caught by Henry. And they'll take him down at the 31-yard line. That catch good for five. It's third down. Well, they're unable to convert that into much, but it's never a bad idea to try to get the ball into a tight end of his caliber's hands and see what kind of disruption he can cause. This is third and two. Maybe the biggest play in this football game. From the gun, Herbert. And Allen's got it. And he is going to have the Chargers first down as this defense unable to hold. It's a seven-yard gain there on third and two. That gets them the first down, but they've still got to move quickly here. First down now, but that clock rolling. Now it's Herbert. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And to the 42-yard line here and brought down there. They'll contain him to just four. Second down. Short gain, short game last two plays. Who do you think's excited about that? Absolutely. This defense, they're saying go right ahead with those. Now the Chargers hustling, trying to get up and get set. Now Herbert. Henry's got it. Out on the left side. That catch good for five. It's third down. They drive some people crazy to see those short throws underneath. They've got to find a way to gash the defense downfield. They'll get to the line here, but remember, it's also third down. Herbert now to throw. Got a man. It's complete. Williams. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. Great way to convert on third down there. 21 yards the play. But one of the ways the quarterbacks keep all the receivers alive in a play, never lock in on any one guy. Make sure you keep your eyes moving, scan the field. And here he finds the open guy for a nice pickup. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. 
Now Eckler. And he'll be marked down at the 26 with a gain of seven. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 37 seconds to play. A good run got seven on first. Here's second and three. It's Eckler again. And he'll be brought down at the 21, just shy of the 20 in the red zone. Now a second timeout called for by the defense as the clock will stop with 33 seconds remaining. on the ground with Eckler. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. The Chargers going to signal for the first of their timeouts as they stop it with 28 seconds to go in this football game. Eight yards the tally on that first down run. Here's second and two. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. Now the Chargers will use the second of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 25 ticks remaining on the clock. A game-winning field goal would be a chip shot from here. Let's see how they play it on first and goal. On the ground, it's Eckler. And they'll be driven back here, losing yardage to the 10-yard line. It's a loss of a yard there, and it's second down. It's a loss of one. Brings up second and goal at the Chiefs' 10-yard line. So here we go. Maybe the biggest kick of the game forthcoming. 27-yard attempt. And it is good. He splits the uprights on the chip shot. And they've come in here and stolen one on the road. Well, a little drama there at the end, but really this thing was already decided. The late points get scored, and then it ends on the kickoff. And I'm right there with you, partner. At the end of the game, they knew what they had to do. Just make sure you don't cough up the football at the end. Just take care of it, and victory was theirs, and that's exactly what they did. So that'll just about do it for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, log on to easports.com. From Kansas City, so long, everybody.